Does your medicine cabinet look anything like this? Well, this is real life, raw and uncut. And <laughs> Boss Lady's medicine cabinet looks like this. So, I am going to pull everything out of there and see what is worth keeping and what is worth getting rid of. To help me get organized, I have some Dollar Tree bins that I plan to use to get my life back on track. Um, these bins were not bought recently. I've actually had these bins for over a year. All of these green and white ones here. The brown one was bought for my linen closet. I just pulled it out of the linen closet uh, so I can corral those medicines that I know are good and going to go into one of these bins as well as clean out my medicine cabinet slash kitchen cabinet. So stay tuned for the final reveal. Okay, and so here is the finished product of me cleaning out the um cabinet here and filling some containers up so my brown container over there still has some things in it that's going to go in a different uh cabinet uh it's just some probiotics probiotics and inhalers but i have everything else in here um so let me show you what's what so the first container is just nothing but cough drops throat lozenges things of that nature there's a few different kinds in there as you can see so that's the first container this container back here is what I call nothing but allergies. Um, I have different types of allergy medications as well as nose sprays. Um, so yes, I have Claritin, I have Zyrtec or the generic brand of Zyrtec. Um, I also have the generic brand of Claritin. I also have, um, what is this? Allergy Severe, the Walgreens brand. So yes, I have a lot of different um, allergy medications because we suffer from allergies a lot in this house. This next basket, um, it's kind of a hodgepodge. I would say this is our cold and flu type of basket as well as anything gastro. <laughs> so, um, I have like, um, the generic brand of the nasal de decongestant, non-drowsy. It's like the, um, Sudafed. So I have what well, CVS brand and the uh, Walmart brand in there. Um, I also have some cold and uh, cold multi symptoms medication in here. I have two different boxes of Alka Seltzer. As you can see, they're both open. Um, I also have some Zycam for cold remedy. I have something old school in here, castor oil. <laughs> um, I also have. Uh, what is this? This is a oral um, allergy medication. It's for Miss Peanut. Was well, um, subscribed to Miss Peanut, but we both can use it. This is the generic version of Benadryl. Um, I have to take it, and she does too. If we have allergic reaction to something, and then, like I said, we have some gastro stuff. So this right here is all of like Emodium and Gas X things of that nature. We also have some Docolex in there. Uh, we have some Theraflu at the bottom and some Robitussin. So that's what's in that particular uh, basket there. Uh, this basket here is prescription meds. I won't go through this, but there's just some prescription meds that's for the family that's in this particular um, container. So I won't go through what those medications are. Just know that that's prescriptions. This one here is our pain reliever uh, box. So I have... Ibuprofen in here. I have anything Tylenol related basically in here. Um, I also have some Excedrin migraine in here. I have a leave in here. Uh, this little tube that fell. This is actually not pain reliever related, but this is the Dramamine just in case if I have any type of vertical situations. And then the rest of that is all just pain reliever, Tylenol. Um, the Tylenol brand or generic brands of Tylenol from either Walgreens or Walgreens or Walmart. Then in this last basket, this is my, I would call this my immunity <laughs> basket here. So I have my elderberry gummies in here, my emergency immune plus. I also have the regular emergencies in here. It's just in a plastic bag, a few different flavors. 
I also have two different flavors of Airborne in here, as you can see. And then the medication that I cannot pronounce, um, this here. And this is for flu-like symptoms, body aches, headache, fever, chills, fatigue. So I have that in here as well. And that's what's in these baskets. So now let me go ahead and put the baskets up in the cabinet and I'll just show you how it looks. And here is everything all put away in the cabinet. So I just used one full shelf. Um, before I had everything kind of on like two, three different shelves and just kind of in a corner of each shelf. And so now I've designated this one whole shelf full of medication for our family. So I still have room to grow. I can put another basket up here if I want to, but that's what it looks like there. So those are the two baskets at the bottom and then the one at the top, or two at the top, excuse me. Then I have this one here, and then I have that over there. So, yep, that is my medicine cabinet slash kitchen cabinet full of medications ready for anything that's coming our way. So thanks for watching, guys. See you on a new video. Bye.